understanding, take after someone, a deep dive into English phrases. Hello and welcome to our channel. Today, we're exploring a fascinating phrase in the English language, take after someone. Whether you're learning English as a second language or simply expanding your linguistic knowledge, understanding such expressions can greatly enhance your fluency and comprehension. So, let's dive in and uncover the meaning behind this phrase. To take after someone means to resemble a family member in appearance, behavior, or temperament. It's often used to express the genetic or learned traits that pass from one generation to another. For instance, when someone says, you take after your mother, it means you have qualities, either physical or personality-wise, that are similar to your mother's. Understanding through examples can make the meaning clearer. Physical resemblance. Everyone says I take after my grandfather because we both have the same smile. Behavioral traits. She takes after her father in her love for music. They both play the piano beautifully. Temperament. He takes after his uncle's calm and patient temperament. These examples show how the phrase can be applied to various aspects of similarity between relatives. The phrase, take after, is idiomatic and has been in use for centuries. It originates from the idea of taking or inheriting certain traits or characteristics from predecessors. Understanding its origin helps in grasping the full nuance of its usage in modern English. Be specific. You can make your conversation more engaging by specifying the trait or characteristic you're referring to. Cultural sensitivity. Remember, the concept of family resemblance in behavior or appearance can be perceived differently across cultures. Practice. Try using take after in your sentences to describe friends or family members, enhancing your fluency in English. We hope this video has shed light on the phrase take after someone and enriched your understanding of English expressions. Remember, language learning is a journey filled with discovery and growth. Keep exploring, and don't hesitate to take after the linguistic adventurers who've come before you. Thank you for watching, and see you in our next video.